Welcome to Mortician's Tale. September 14th. I didn't read the rest. God, this is the exact same color palette as art school. Motherfucker. It's, <laughs> it's a sequel. conspiracy. That's a lot of email. Well, that's that's reading. Hello and welcome to our new funeral director. Welcome to our new director. Welcome to does our seem, new... Does that seem weirdly strange? Isn't a funeral director a, a person as opposed to like a place or a job? No, I mean, it might they're be like, that they're extending a hello and welcome to the new funeral director. Oh, they're welcoming the funeral director. That, yeah. Welcome to the funeral director. <laughs> you live in here now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Today's tasks. I think you'll enjoy working here. Amy's a sweetheart, but she runs a type chip. Today's actual tasks is a, is a lot. There's a lot going on here. Special you probably, you request for my mother's funeral. Read this. That's a lot of back and forth. Uh, uh, three nineteen p.m. Three twenty-two p.m. Oh, so it starts. No, I'm, it, at the top. It starts down what here. The tasks are. No, yeah. What? Yeah. Okay. That's probably a good thing because Bert, it, 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 you, you and I both know that Keith's not going to read it. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I normally read There's things, one thing but Keith it... sucks at it's uh, paying attention <laughs> to instructions. <laughs> yeah. I read, I read like, everything when I'm alone, but when there's two people talking in my ear, it shuts down. <laughs> All right, completely. Oh, yeah, no. You no, got, no, no. you got great excuses. Talking. Yep, let's just stop talking so we can read. Yeah. They close. Oh, this, I thought they said they were closed-minded. <laughs> it's a closed casket funeral. <laughs> I hope you're set it in okay so far. <laughs> <laughs> well, that seems counterintuitive to what we're trying to do here. We're trying no, to they're explain. Not dead. We're trying to explain death to them. Oh no. <laughs> Matthew should have dropped off your first body for you to work on. He said you're you are really friendly, so he's glad to have someone young and lively to work with. You'll get used to a sense of humor. <laughs> You, yes, your first body, really friendly with a dead body. Your first body is Mrs. Garcia, an elderly woman who died suddenly of a heart attack. The family has asked for a closed casket funeral, so no embalming or body preparation is necessary. The family seems a bit more united than previous families we've dealt with. United? Strange how grief affects people differently. Perhaps having more time to say goodbye makes things a little easier, if that's possible. That being said, although you will not be embalming Mrs. Garcia, I do think it's important to take time to clean her body. No one is going to see her body, but I like to encourage my funeral directors to do this out of respect for the deceased and their loved ones. You'll find Mrs. Garcia in the prep room. All right, who's ready to clean a corpse? You didn't even see what the instructions were. Wasn't that the instructions? No. Did I not just read it? Right, why aren't you helping me? You're just sitting there. Go to the top, there's a tab, Rose and Daughters, right? What? <clears throat> this oh. is our ad. Okay. That was well, the. In uh, I read the instructions. It's cool. the Give instruction. Reply. The inst There's no. There's no replying. At the top. At the top. What? Oh. Sure thing. I'll get right to it. Damn. You're right. There. Now <laughs> it highlights everything. I, I finished reading all the directions. You're like, you didn't even read the directions you just read. You didn't. This is the Ew. prep room. Yeah. This is gonna be a happy one. This is. This is a happy game. <laughs> Happy game, dude. Because <laughs> the families are close to the I told you not to play this one. <laughs> Wait. Oh, this is morbid. Eye caps. What are eye caps? Hang on, I gotta sponge bath this grandma's corpse. There we go. How's everyone's day then? <laughs> well, at least this is Put over. in the casket. <laughs> You're responsible for taking care of the diseased body, but it's also important to pay your respects to the loved ones. Follow the arrow to lead to head to the funeral parlor. I'm just gonna walk directly from wa wiping their their family's body member. <laughs> family's body member. Family. I did. <laughs> Wait, I was body member. I was just in the back room, like right there. I Go wait the snack bar, dude. What There's are? cakes and coffee. There are. Uh, there does appear what to be the food. fuck? You can't. Yeah, I don't think I get to have the food. There's no perks working in a mortician's <laughs> office, apparently. <laughs> we are the hosts. Yeah, I heard the family specifically said no embalming. Thought it was mandatory, like required by law, but I guess not. Embalming weirds me out. Do those chemicals leach into the ground? Seems strange to be using a chemical that's known to cause cancer and putting it into the ground like that. Or into the sewer. That's what they must do with the leftover formaldehyde, right? Just pour it down the drain. 
At least embalming guarantees you won't be buried alive. <laughs> Stop it. Don't make me laugh right now. You think that's bad? I bet this place has 5G Wi-Fi. Talk about cancer. Wow. Topical. Yeah. Unfortunately. Nailed it. <laughs> we usually don't small talk a lot at these things. At least that's what I was usually taught. Okay. Look at those people admiring the art school piece. It <laughs> I have painted bowls of fruit before. She would have hated these paintings. She was so particular. At least she doesn't seem to have to see them, I guess. That's... yeah, I guess. Everyone's just coping with brutal humor. You're supposed to go to the casket. I don't oh. want to. I already did go to the casket. You're not paying any attention. Oh. I was paying attention just to the things that you're you. not doing. I mean, wait, <laughs> except for all the, the ones things that, that you're I doing. Did do. There is legitimately a lot going on here. Corsets, TLDR, thank you. <laughs> Corsets probably messed up some bones, but I likely didn't do this kind of internal organ damage, and I'm tired of the condescension about my wardrobe that also implies I don't know what I'm doing. There's like a password. Or says it didn't do anything to the livers, they're not gonna hurt me. This person's very opinionated about corsets, or specifically the people around them are. <clears throat> Here are my instructions for the next body. Did a remarkable job on the first one by wiping it for 10 seconds with a sponge. The family was very happy <laughs> with you. Remarkable! No small feat, His of course. wiping technique is amazing. Pleasing a grieving family isn't exactly the most comfortable of jobs. The next job is a man named Mr. Duvall, an elderly man, died of old age. Nothing fancy, just a standard funeral with embalming. You can reach out to his daughter, Lizzie Duvall, if you have questions. She's handled her father's passing as well as can be expected. Just standard embalming. How do you do an embalming? Charlie, dear, please remember to wear proper embalming gear. Formaldehyde is extremely dangerous. My, inter my maternal instincts are taking over. We need, to, we need to get dressed. Oh, I'm already dressed up. <laughs> Alright, time for the exciting shit. We're about to... Taxidermy this man. <laughs> Uh, reserves the body to, to, for against decomposition. Usually, the family requests otherwise. Is it? it? What is this going to become? Like the fucking papers, please. Of <laughs> like, you get moral people. choice. It's like, is it okay to embalm this body? What if? <laughs> what, what if? What if I can embalm get, this like, body in a way so that I, overthrows the get, government? Like, more you get more and more fucked up requests. It's like they're from West Greston, so you're not supposed <laughs> to give them embalming fluid. You get moral way, choices. What's your question for you earlier? What the eye uh, the eye caps are? Um, they are placed on the eyes, similar to contacts, to hold the eyelid shut. I need to massage the body. You're essentially scalpel. draining. You're draining no. the body of any excess fluid to fill it with formaldehyde. That's the, definitely not what it says on the screen. <laughs> I uh, know. Quit rubbing his nipple, dude. Oh, there we go. Oh, break rigor mortis. Oh, okay. oh. That's where you go. You start at the top. And the, I'm massaging the body is how they're going. Eyes deflate once the body starts decomposing. Oh. So Keith, this was your the, idea. You the, eye caps, the eye caps are to give the eyes the shape of an eye. Oh, boy. Once the eye... Uh, to keep the eyes shut, you'll need to glue them. Click and drag the glue onto each eye to shut it. There we go. He looks so peaceful. <laughs> the mouth sags and hollows once the body starts decomposing. Click and drag a cotton ball. They fill the mouth with cotton. And then they suture it. I'm learning things. Yeah. Aren't you happy we played this game? We could have not learned these things, and that would have been a shame. I'm drawing a Stussy on I this like corpse. I like the <laughs> 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 oh no. Uh, where's the drainage tube? You. Everyone in chat, donate five dollars to get Keith to stop playing this game. <laughs> it's now become the extortion charity scheme. 
Drag it to the cardioid artery. I don't even know where that is. Is this the canula? Click on the canula. Is this, oh, that's the canula. That's the canula. There we go. Oh boy, oh right, the canula. It's the powerhouse of the cell. <laughs> the canula's the powerhouse of the cell. Get more tubing to connect the embalming machine to the canula. How do I connect the embalming? I assume this is the embalming machine. Where do I, I click don't on fucking it? fucking know. You think I'm some sort of mortician? Yes. Oh. You need to grab some additional tubing. This is some it's tubing. In the, it's in the bottom. I'm gonna drag it to the canula. The choker. What's it? Ah. It's so. like a timer starts counting down. <laughs> <laughs> you have to disarm this bomb with the bombing fluid. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Click the button. Oh, I did it. When did I do that? You did it. Yeah. Wait. When know. did I? When did I succeed? You clicked on. You clicked on the canula, but like the top of it. I don't know when I succeeded. There's, there's a tube slot in the canula. <laughs> Dumbass. And now I need to massage the chemicals through the corpse's body. There we go. There, there we, go. we go. Like you know what you're doing. Yeah, I'm just kind of stroking places. And it's like squeezing the blood out. It's kind of like when you hit the part <laughs> where like you already drank all the fluid out of the slushy, and now it's just like chunky ice at the bottom, and you're trying to like mix it with your straw <laughs> so that you can get God. the rest out. <laughs> I just, I just want you to massage me like one of your French corpses. dead guys. <laughs> <laughs> you need to drain the organs of any remaining flu fluids. Oh, Jesus. Just Don't hit him in the duodenum. stab it in there. Oh, man. Oh, the gallbladder. Oh, the cadneys. There we go. How much fluid is there in there? Where is it going? I, I, I... I can't hear any sound effects, but I gotta imagine that that sound effect <laughs> is just like the sound where you're drinking something from a straw <laughs> and there's no liquid at the end, so it's just like... <laughs> oh, the X's go away when you get rid of all the fluid. Yeah. There we go. We're getting there. We're gonna wring this... this old man dry. It's gonna be like that Jackie Chan <laughs> movie about the water that makes you thirsty. <laughs> You're all done. Dow will take care of his makeup, as well as dressing and putting him in a casket. Oh, Mike will take care of it. What if I want to dress up the corpses? What if I'm fully invested in this process? You gotta get promoted first. You gotta get prom you gotta get promoted. You gotta work yourself up to putting on makeup. He always wanted to take his grandkids to the park, play catch. He loved playing catch. He threw him at a curveball, that's for sure. A man a curveball? Uh, I, I, I actually said he threw a man a curveball, but he said he threw him a mean curveball. I guess that sentence threw you a curveball. Yeah. I'm gonna bow three times for at maximum respect. This kid is playing a DS. I'm gonna slap him. <laughs> Don't hum to me, fucking moral oral over here. He does look like moral oral. <laughs> so strange not seeing most people wearing white. Well, it's not white. a wedding. Yeah, I think it's different for different family members. I can't remember. I haven't gone to many traditional funerals, so mo mostly white, but like definitely not red, no matter what. White. Yeah, isn't like Chinese uh, funerals, like they use white, if I remember right. Maybe. Came out of nowhere. I mean, it always sort of does, doesn't it? Yeah, one minute you're laughing, having fun, and then the next, poof, that person's gone, just like gone. Weird to think about it for too long, like staring into the sun. I start to feel a little fuzzy when I think about it. Hmm. Mm hmm So weird, how our bodies just stop working like that. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> this is a mortician's tale. 
I was Thanks curious for that. This is interesting. We were all curious, but you're yes. sometimes supposed to exercise your curiosity no. alone and in the dark. No, I, I embrace. No one's there. I embrace the curiosity. I dove straight in. Hey guys, if you liked what you saw in this video, you can get this game and 1,600 other games for five dollars or more. Pay what you want beyond that point uh, via the bundle for racial justice and equality on itch.io. Proceeds go to the NAACP and to bail funds. And to give like some perspective on just how much shit's being added to this thing at this point, like here's Night in the Woods, A Short Hike, Celeste, Minute, Arcade Spirits, Anodyne, Nuclear Throne, The White Door, Glitter Mitten Grove, Quadrilateral Cowboy, One Shot the Hex, 2064, Read Only Memories, and Pyre. And that's just some of the stuff I've found. Like there's so much there's so much stuff being added to this this bundle in rapid fire that I can't even keep track anymore. You can also check out the other link in the description to go to our Tiltify campaign if you want to help raise money for color of change. Thanks for watching and thanks for giving a shit.